Are you a Viper main? Do your teammates keep calling Viper a low tier agent? Her kit seems much less straightforward than some other agents, but in the right hands, her utility can contribute in many creative ways. Today we'll be covering part 1 of my 2 part series for Viper executes and setups that are essential for attacking and defending both sites on the map bind. I'm Psionic Kevin and you can follow me on Twitch and the social links down below. A quick disclaimer, these lineups are specific to my current crosshair settings, so using your personal settings may require some fine tuning and adjustments. I'll link my settings down in the description below. First we have the showers one way smoke. You jump onto the pipe, then onto the box next to the showers. Look straight down, aim your center of the crosshair on the edge of the box, and the vertical line aligned with the fold in the cloth. Look for the third orange rectangle from the left side starting at the height where the bell is. Position your crosshair slightly left from the middle of that rectangle and with the bottom of the crosshair just on the outer rim of the arch. Then you short throw by right clicking. With this one way in place you will be able to see the bottom of their legs if they try to peek out and they won't be able to see anything at all. Moving on we have the short A double box one way. You face the diagonal wall near the bottom of the stairs, look straight down, align the vertical part of the crosshair with the edge of the first stair. Turning to the right, center the crosshair on the bottom right edge of the protruding roof line, and then do a normal throw by left clicking. I personally don't like this one as much compared to the bathrooms one way because it's just not as perfectly positioned, and I think a cipher coin on this box would actually be way more effective for short players. Our third smoke is a Heaven Orb smoke from Showers. Looking straight down, line up your crosshair on the bottom left corner where the darker tiles intersect near the towels on the ground. Place the center of the crosshair in the middle of the left roof line, then normal throw by left clicking. You can also molly triple using the same position from the heaven orb smoke. Looking straight down line up the crosshair on the bottom left corner where the darker tiles intersect near the towels. Place the center of the crosshair just inward of this specific sharp point and shoot the molly. When done correctly, you can actually molly triple and then throw your heaven orb smoke with just about a half second delay between the two popping. If you want to molly the right corner of showers exiting onto a site, then you need to look straight down, line up the crosshair one tile down from the color change and one tile from the wall. Align the vertical line with the small gray mark above the color change on the wall with the center of the crosshair on the line of the color change. Shift it to the right just a little bit so that the back of the molly will cover the entirety of the pipe and then shoot the molly. Next up we have the U-Haul molly from A Short near Spawn. Get in the corner near the stairs and below the trees. Center your crosshair on the top edge of the leaf where the middle point of the diagonal slant before the yellow curves down sharply. Then shoot your molly. This will force the U-Haul player to either swing out wide onto short or back up into U-Haul. Moving on to the CT molly from B Long, you get in the corner wall on the fountain side of B Long. Align the bottom of the crosshair at the top of the vertical line of the left side of the container. The spacing for the right side of the crosshair should be just on the edge of that same vertical line. Then shoot the molly. You can also molly left side of the container from B Long in the same position. Get in the corner wall on fountain side of B Long. Align the vertical part of the crosshair with the left point of this panel line. Align the horizontal part of the crosshair with the imaginary horizontal line from the top of the container, and then shoot the molly. You can make your own adjustments to the right or to the left more depending on where you want this molly to land.
You can also molly elbow from fountain. Get in this specific corner of the fountain, align the vertical part of the crosshair a quarter from the right side of the left half of the horizontal part of the pole. The very bottom of the crosshair should be just a few pixels above the imaginary horizontal line created from the far right point of that horizontal bar. Then shoot the molly. Last but not least, we have a CT smoke orb from B Long Portal. Get in the corner wall on portal side of B Long. Align the vertical part of the crosshair with the right point of the third bump from the left. Then align the horizontal part of the crosshair with the bottom of the tiny yellow thing on the right side. Run and throw the orb approximately a quarter of a second after moving. This is a run throw with a relatively forgiving margin of error, so most of the times you should be able to land this consistently. And that concludes part one of this series. If you learned something new and you enjoyed the video, don't forget to drop a like and subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you guys in the next one.